Hello there, and welcome back to the Alvarez family. In this part, it's Carlos's last day off for the week. So, I think we're going to spend some time in the afternoon with little Sophia. But for now, she's going to go to preschool. I don't know if she needs to go, but she can go in preschool. It's fine. So, maybe, because tomorrow is summer holiday. He's going to have that day off. So maybe, and tomorrow we're going to spend time with family. Maybe today, while Sophia's at school, we can meet up with Alistair. Maybe we should go to his house for once. Oh. Okay. He wants to become best friends. Sure. <laughs> Hello. Becoming, oh, by the way, I uh, installed the Wonderful Whims mod. Oh. Okay, yes. <laughs> Great. Okay, so Alistair wants to take things to the next level. Will Carlos be his boyfriend? See, now Carlos wasn't, like, too sure about what's going on. And, you know, is he gay? Is he not? Is he bi? Um, so, but he's obviously liking them, you know? They got the bar quite high. So I think we're just going to say yes. And we now have a boyfriend. Maybe we should get up and give him a kiss. Yeah, so I was saying I downloaded the... Um, the Wonderful Whims mod. Just because of the attractiveness. That whole part. That was really the the only reason why I got it. Um, just quite useful. Can we ask? Let's see. Where... Well, looking common as appearance, of course. Can we ask what he thinks of our, what, the way we look? Is, is it this? It's like if we ask him, what will he say? Will he say that he's attracted to us? Or will he just say what he likes? Let's see. Okay. Doesn't really say that much. Oh, he's cleaning our house. How nice. But cute. Now he has a boyfriend. Just picking up all these things. Harvesting the flowers and selling them. We need the money for sure. He is... Well, he... We'll see how he does Saturday when he goes to work. But hopefully, it won't, it won't take too long for him to get a promotion. Because... He deserves it. You know, he's been doing a good job. He's probably worked like, two, what, two days? But it doesn't matter. He deserves it. He deserves a better job. Position. Okay, should we go to your house, Alistair? Let's go to yours. So, Alistair lives. And for Don Bagley. There he is. So let's go with him. And here we are. So I have... Oh! He has a cow. Let's go say hello to the cow. Let's go feed the cow, actually. Um, if we can. Can we go feed the cow? Yes. So I have... This is just the house that came with the, with the pack. Like, it just comes in the slot. I changed a couple of things. And I changed some wallpaper. But I pretty much just kept it as it was. Because I thought it was quite cute. Um, I'm assuming that it was a simmer that built this. Because usually... Because they've been doing that for a while, haven't they? Um, but, yeah. Ooh! Yes, Megan, you definitely should try for a baby. Because then we can have... I guess it's not going to be the same age as Sophia, but it's still nice to have, like, a baby. And yes, try for that baby. Do it. Hopefully they get pregnant. Because that would be super cute. Ask about health. Oh, that's... Maybe we should ask about health. We just became boyfriends. And I'm not trying to be... You know suggestive or anything but i feel like it's time like no one in real life becomes 
well, no adults really, unless you're super uh, like Christian or religious. I don't know. Uh, no adults go steady without doing things of a certain level of intimacy. So maybe we should just ask him. We should try to get him flirty. And we should ask him if he wants to. Maybe in the shower. Ooh, he has a lover personality. He craves intimacy, and I think they both have that same trait, actually. So that works perfectly, because if they, they, they crave intimacy, then there you go. Go be intimate. Enjoy. Go on. Enjoy, boys. Ooh, rabbits! Oh, I forgot about the rabbits. They're so cute. Come on, boys. We gotta go back home now. Okay. Lovely to see you. Yes, and goodbye. We'll leave it at that, actually. Bye. We gotta go home. Oh, I hate when they get this fear. It's so annoying. Like, oh, he's, he's not a lover. Oh, right. Okay, okay. It was Alistair that's a lover. What is he then? A fool? And a caregiver. Okay, that's cute. Um... How do you feel unfulfilled? Please tell me how you feel unfulfilled. Do you see what you're doing? Do you see where you're going? You just... This man just asked to be your boyfriend. You have a daughter. You have a decent job. How can you be unfulfilled? What are your dreams? You're about to get to the next level of that. Oh, mom. Thanks. I was a bit worried that she wouldn't have been happy. But thankfully... She actually was very happy with it. Okay, we'll just meet you back home because this is going to take a while, isn't it? And we are back. What is he doing here? You need to go now. Like, we've had enough of that. Like, we can't just be spending all day. Okay, I guess we can invite you in. Fine. But you, little girl. Come to daddy. Oh, cute. Oh, f go away. Okay, let's see her skills and what she still needs to level up. Imagination and thinking. And she has, what, three days? Two days. Imagination and thinking. Okay, so let's read her a book. We need to do that anyway for his um, aspiration. Oh, she's just very hot. Okay, change your clothes then. Can we change your clothes? Do it. Change, 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 change. Quickly, quickly. Yeah, there we go. Um, can you read her a book, please? There we go. Who's that over there? What? This is very random. What is she drinking? A lemonade. From where? Where'd you get that lemonade? Why does it keep walking around here? He looks so weird now. I don't know what you guys think of some of the skin tones they introduced, right? But I feel like some of these look a bit gray, you know? Especially if you turn off... Yeah, that looks so gray. Doesn't it? I think it does. Maybe it's just because I always do, like, warm skin tones. She's getting that imagination skill up, which is what we need, what we like. Oh yeah, the skills go up quite fast as well because we live in a tiny house. I don't I didn't ha actually have this set up from the beginning. Oh. Our neighbors here as well. But now I do and it's an actual tiny home. Uh and we get yeah, t a tier 2. So we get skills increase at double the standard rate. Everything's twice as comfortable. Less bills. And happy, inspired, and focused buffs last twice as long, which is great. That's what we need. That's what we like. Oh, stop. Just do it. Okay, he wants to discuss his fear, so do it with Alistair. There we go. We did it. And I'm assuming...
she's got her skill up as well. Yes, yeah, she did. Okay, so you can go home. You can eat some food. Talk about your fears. Discuss your fears. And there you go. You did it. Now you feel better. Okay, Alistair, I, I do think it's time for you to go. You've been here long enough today. Gardening level two. Oh, look at them. And she's about to grow up so soon. So I don't know, like, if... You know, if things go well with Alistair, does that mean that we should... You know, would they eventually get together? Will they go live with Alistair? Will they live here? Like, I don't know. What should we do? What do you guys think? Like, if do you think that he should stay with Alistair? Do you like Alistair? And what do you think we should do? Should we move to Alistair? Should we move somewhere else in Oasis Springs? Because, let's be honest here, Carlos loves the heat. And he loves sunny weather, so Oasis Springs is the place to be for him. With that being said, that doesn't mean that he wouldn't, you know, go somewhere else to be with someone that he in the future would love, you know, if they would stay together. But I don't know. I don't know if Alistair would make him move all the way to Henford. Oh, that's where she got the lemonade from. That makes sense. Ooh, what do they have? Mm, a bunch of trash. Ooh. Is this... What are you doing here? You know this is not a kissing booth, right? That's something more of your style, sweetie. But, yeah. There we go. Oh, that's a mess. Clean that up. Oh, she's sad because she made a mess. It's okay, sweetie. You want to be friendly with your dad? Well, maybe he can help you a bit with this, actually. Maybe we'll move it to the living room, actually. So it's a bit more like... So there's a bit more space for everyone to reach. No! I clicked the wrong one. Damn it. Don't go to sleep! There we go. Well, he's feeling very confident from all these good things let's see what these what's going on with these people does he have anything friendly advice that's from when he asked her for advice nothing with his dad should probably give him a call oh johnny i haven't spoken to him in a while perceived as basic looking okay <laughs> um i'm not sure how because as far as I'm aware, they both have, um, well, he has, he's attractive to, you know, like preferred hair color. His hair color is in it, you know? So I'm not sure how, maybe we should add red as well. Mm, facial hair, beard. So I'm not sure how he thinks he's basic looking. But that's all right. He still likes him, I guess. Maybe let's just find someone more attractive at some point. You never know who you're going to find in your lifetime. Okay, it's enough. It's time for Sophia to go to sleep. It's 10 p.m. You can't be staying up all this time, girl. Oh, please just do it. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> I never really get those, to be honest. I used to get them loads in the... No, what, what do you... Okay, she's just gone to sleep. Fine, whatever. Just tuck her in. Uh, he's probably going to watch a bit of TV, just to get that, s the, that cooking skill up a bit. You know, why not? He's gonna need it anyway, in life and in for work. What did we get a... What was it? Oh, adoring. Oh. Super cute. Oh, we have our photos that we've been taking with our friends. Forgot about those. We can put these on the wall. Saw that. Actually, we could probably keep that. 
uh, let's see. Models, or, no, we're gonna do this one that I used for the thumbnail for the last part. I thought it'd be, it would be cute. Okay, there we go. We'll get rid of the other ones. There we go. Us and our friends and our boyfriend. And can you believe they're gonna have a baby? <laughs> and all because of us. Because we told them to have a baby. Imagine doing that in real life, you know, calling your friends and be like, do you think I should have a baby? Yes or no? If you say yes, I'm gonna have a baby. Like that's insanity. But anyway, we're gonna end this part here. Because in the next part, we're going to have lots and lots and lots to do. So yeah, that's going to be it. Hope you enjoyed. Thank you. And bye-bye.